Hello friends and neighbors, Dr. Pickett here, telling you how to share your music or video app in a WebEx meeting with decent quality. It's not going to be great quality, but it's going to be good enough to work with if you're in music or doing a video or some kind of a film project. Okay, the first thing that you want to do is begin your WebEx meeting. That seems obvious, but you've got to have that WebEx meeting open. The second thing you want to make sure of is that the application that you want to share with your students whether it's something like Final Cut Pro or in this case I'm using music and so you have to have that application open. So after you get your application over, open, come back to WebEx and move your cursor to the bottom of the screen and click on this icon, that square with the arrow. That allows you to share the application. So when you click on that icon, you're gonna get this box that says share content. So when you see that box, what you're looking at is all the apps that are open on your computer, okay? So in the upper left-hand corner, you're going to see a kind of nondescript pull-down menu that says optimize for text and images. That is not what you want. Not if you're gonna hear music, you have to change it. Click on the drop-down menu and optimize it for motion and video. Optimize it for motion and video. Once you've done that, you um, are probably going to be prompted if you haven't um, used this before. Do you want to download the drivers for this? And you're going to answer yes. You want to download the drivers and make sure that you install them. Actually, it installs automatically on a Macintosh. Um, it only takes a few seconds. Do it. Now let me draw your attention to the box next to this. Share your computer audio. Make sure that little checkbox there is checked. Okay, now double click on the app that contains the music that you wanna share or whatever project that you're working on. I'm gonna double click on Dorico here because I'm a music teacher and I teach composition. And when you do that, you're gonna see your app pop up almost like normal, okay? Except at the top of it, you're going to see something that says you're sharing Dorico. It's an orange sign that tells you you're sharing your application, okay? Then you know it's working, but wait a minute, maybe it's not working. Well, that's probably because your app is not set up with audio drivers to um, push its content out onto your meeting. So what you need to do in a music application is go to the preferences area and select your audio drivers, okay? Find the audio device that you're uh, in your preference area of your application and then make sure that it is selected to WebEx Media Audio Device. That's the driver that you just downloaded. It has to be selected to that or else it's not gonna work. You think you're done, right? Not quite, because something is going to probably happen. If you're using a music app, you may have to restart it to ensure that the drivers are properly installed. It doesn't happen all the time, but sometimes it doesn't. Music apps are picky. So if you don't hear anything, restart your music app, video app, and then go back to step two of this presentation. Do not pass go, do not collect $200. This is Dr. Pickett wishing you best wishes for your creative endeavors in all of life.